everybody. Welcome to Tuesday video where I do whatever I want. And today, I want to do beauty hacks slash skin remedies stuff. I don't really know what it is. I'm not a beauty guru, don't ask me questions. So I wanted to do just different online tips for home remedies on beauty crap. And everything online said all I needed to do, some organic honey and an egg. Multiple eggs, but for just the sake, I didn't want to take all of them out. I just wanted to bring one out. Welcome to my bathroom. All right, so the first one we're gonna start off with is the nose peel. We're gonna get rid of the pores on my nose because apparently that's what you're supposed to do. This one requires Egg whites are cooking in the bathroom. I put my hair up because I'm about to put egg on my face. And then cover with a tissue. When the mask completely dries, peel off the paper. Okay. Mm -hmm. so just do it with my hands? Like how do I put it on my face? Ooh. Okay. Yep, there it is. Yep, that's what we're doing right now. <laughs> Got my mouth. That's like bad for you, right? It's like salmonella or something. Boop, boop, boop. I feel like I'm gonna die. Now I put toilet paper on it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, good. Now you're supposed to also put egg whites on your stretch marks. So I'm gonna do that since the egg whites are already out. So you're all gonna see my stretch marks, but I'm not ashamed of them because guess what? Most women have them. I don't know if you can see them in this light, but my stretch marks, I got a bunch right here. I'm supposed to do it with a makeup brush and I don't ever use this one. Egg whites and stretch marks. Yep, that's cold and feels very strange. Now I just look like I've greased myself up. I look really good. These beauty hacks are making me beautiful. Now that I've gone through Snapchat and watched everyone's stories, because that's how long this took, I'm gonna peel this off. Oh, it's actually like really stuck to me, isn't it? Oh, oh, well that's good, great, neat, perfect. Yeah, all that did was leave tissue on my nose. This didn't do anything. That was the stupidest thing I've ever done. My nose doesn't look any different. Let's try the honey one. The eggs on my stretch marks are still drying because it takes like six hours. Don't think that this is a quick tip. It is a long tip. <laughs> so I put some yogurt and honey in a bowl. Ooh, and I mixed it. Apply it to the pores. After a few minutes, rinse it with water. Why does everything take forever to do? This, there it is, there it is. Oh, no, I got it on my shirt. Oh, no. Well, this shirt's ruined. I'm a mess. You think that's good? I'm gonna have to use my hand. Yeah, I'm just gonna pour, just get all over that business. Well, now we wait a few minutes, cause that's fun. Ooh, while we wait, we can take the egg off of my leg. And we'll wash it off, and we'll wash it off, and we'll wash off all of egg. Because it's gross to put eggs on your body, yes it is. So you wash it off, la la la. And then you're supposed to apply olive oil, cause that's good for your skin or something. Nah, it's got olive oil all over the place. Ow! This looks great though. It actually has like a cool sensation, like my nose feels like it's got mint on it and it's like breathing and feeling good. I feel like that maybe that means I should rinse it off because it's been a while. Tastes like honey yogurt. I wonder why. All right, I'm rinsing this off. My nose feels stiff, but also slightly sticky. That might have to do with the honey. But I honestly feel like that did more than the stupid egg toilet paper peel. But speaking of honey, apparently that's a great thing for your lips as well. So all you do is just apply some honey to your lips and then eat it because it tastes good. And you're supposed to do that several times a day. But I had the problem of licking it off. Mm, that actually is fantastic. Yeah, no, that's a good one. I highly suggest putting honey on your lips. It's amazing. It feels great. All right, the last thing we're gonna do today is for my eczema. So I have, I don't think you can see it really. I have really bad eczema. It looks fine in the freaking thing. Okay, well, there's eczema on my arms. You guys have pointed it out a lot of times in my videos when you see the inside of my elbows. Right now they're a little bit tame. Normally they like are super red and it looks really gross. You know what? You can't cure eczema, it's impossible. But I found that if you mix honey with cinnamon, apparently it helps it. You go one part honey, one part cinnamon, mix it together. Only 3% of the world su suffers from eczema. I get to the, be that lucky 3%. I don't wanna dirty something else cause I already have a bunch of dishes to do after this. So we're just stirring with your fi my finger. Not your finger, you're not even here. I mean, you're here in my heart, but but I'm doing all the work right now, here. We've made a thing. Just put it on my eczema, all right. Oh, good. Now no one will notice. There we go. Perfect. No one will ever know. 
I wanna put more honey on my lips. All right, that's all the beauty hacks or tips. I don't know what they are. They're not hacks, because it's not like a little cheap trick. It's like home remedies or something. I don't know, but we're done. It's done for the day. I did my nose, I did my lips, I did my eczema, which this is just sticky now. Like now, <laughs> I'm really cool guys and I did my stretch mark. I don't see any improvement on any of it except that my lips taste really really good I feel like I'd rather go to the store and buy the little strips for my nose and the cream for my eczema Which I already do and chapstick. I feel like my nose is just really red now I feel like that's all I've done is make my nose red. All right I hope you guys like this if there's any other things you want me to do Please comment below and tell me um, thanks for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up if You try any of these beauty tips. I want to see pictures of it. So tell Tag me on Instagram or tweet them to me. Stay awesome, possums.